Hare Krishna, we are here in the middle of France in a very beautiful temple, which is a former castle or a chateau. New Mayapur Dham Ki! So this is the Hare Krishna temple. Um, not only is it a historic building, we're also out in, um, in the countryside of France. So there's beautiful. beautiful lakes, um, there's forests in this area, <laughs> and it's also been home to uh, a French community of devotees for the last 50 years or so. Probably at least. A very, very special place. When Srila Prabhupada himself came um, and installed the beautiful deities of Krishna Balaram, and um, now we have Radha, Govinda Madhavji, Shashi nice. Gaur. Huge Krishna deity. <laughs> really big. So, and the most Dai. beautiful. <laughs> Almost as tall as us, right? Yeah. It's Some of the tall. most beautiful de yeah. deities we've ever seen. And so we've taken a, a road trip from England, uh, driven for a few Yeah, days. where did we go? Uh, um, Paris. South, yep. Stopped over in Paris and then came here and it's just been the most incredible. <laughs> we, we got Haridev, always as usual, running around. They did really well. But we had a really nice stop on the way and we just want to share this incredible place with everyone because we want to invite everyone to come here. There's um, a massive woods and forest and sometimes there are like some, you can see some huts um, and people live in them and it's really cool. There have been, there's, there's a few devotees here who have made their own um, kind of like a small house out of mud and straw and have been living in it for, uh, we, have, we found Ages. out about 21 years and they grow the food and it's just the most beautiful little India they've created of uh, New Mayapur, this place is called New Mayapur because There's even like a, a Govardhan, they made a Govardhan hill oh, yeah, with like yeah. um, and, 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 and then there's, there's like, something next to that way you can You can swim, swim. Yeah. Yeah, uh, It's just the most beautiful thing and it's really just touched our hearts so much because the person we met, uh, Gopaswami Prabhu, how happy was he? He yeah, was really so happy. He brought us <laughs> into his um, hut and it was awesome. It's his house, but it's literally like you can barely fit three people in it. And it was so, it's so warm in the winter and so cool in the summer. We're here in the summer and it was just so divine. When you see someone like this live this, this philosophy of the Sanatan Dharma, simple living, high thinking, it really transforms you to the core. That's the power of purity. Srila Prabhupada says purity is the force. That when we live a pure lifestyle, that the vibration is so powerful that it can bring about change in another human being. <laughs> it, can, it can cleanse us when we associate with such pure people, uh, with such a clean consciousness who are always thinking of this absolute truth about Krishna and how to serve him. Uh, and we spend time with Jananda Swami who is <laughs> a transcendental. He's also living in a, in a uh, very sustainable Vedic style of hut basically. And uh, it just gives you a glimpse of this alternate reality. We can live this life which is just um, in tune with nature and it actually allows us to be happy. Uh, we, don't, we don't have to rely on so many external things, right? And we just want to invite you all to come and visit to help support this incredible temple of Sri Krishna. Anywhere in Europe, it's just a short drive away or a flight into tours at, into this <laughs> spiritual world almost. We're in the in the middle of uh, the heart of France and everywhere you look it's just absolute um, beauty. This absolutely gorgeous chateau was almost shut down uh, a few weeks ago because they, all the internal wiring, the electrics are so old and uh, everything has to be updated and the community, you know, it's in the middle of nowhere so there's not much uh, financial <laughs> income, so we need some support. We need your help to keep this beautiful place um, open. So I just wanted to also introduce to you the temple president and his wife and their beautiful daughter Sangeeta and we can hear from them um, the help that we need and support. So we're here with uh, Lochananda Prabhu and Gandharvika and their absolutely gorgeous little baby Sangeeta. <laughs> Um, and we just wanted to hear from you about this incredible place you look after and uh, we're hoping to convince you to all visit. <laughs> How is it going? <laughs> uh, it's, it's definitely challenging. We, uh, we are uh, doing our best to uh, convey the message. Uh, it's been uh, 
tough last three months, mm. but Krishna is reciprocating. Uh, devotees are definitely helping. We still uh, we are halfway through, or a little bit less than that. Uh, if devotees can yeah. shower their mercy a little bit more, <laughs> that will uh, let, let takes us to the mark. Right. So so just a little backtrack. Uh, we need to redo the entire electrics of the building. Yes. Right? Yes. So fire doors, uh, yeah, exit uh, system. Um, fire. Uh, Smoke alarms. Smoke centralized smoke alarm. The government is uh, asking us to be fully up to the norms to receive public. Right. It and was considered a private property before. Now they see that many devotees visiting from the UK and lots of local visitors as well. Yeah. So they want us to be up to the norms. Of course. How old is the chateau? Uh, next to 100 years. So uh, <laughs> the roof, everything has to, is slowly degrading. We did already 25% of the roof fixed and we still gradually every year do a little portion. Uh, we are now here since uh, almost five years uh, helping to manage this place. Mm -hmm. And uh, yeah, this place is amazing, it's magical. It's so wonderful, <laughs> it's absolutely been, I don't want to leave, we're leaving soon. And it's Do you want to uh, go back? Not really. <laughs> not really. <laughs> it's become another home only in three days because there's so much good energy. The, Srila Prabhupada was here, he installed Krishna Balaram himself, the only place in the world with Vrindavan Dam where he personally installed Krishna Balaram. So there's yes. no question of uh, moving or selling or giving right. up on Yamayapur. This is a dam. It's We've a sacred space. <laughs> it's a yeah. Tirtha, yeah. yeah. And we're ready to give our life for this place. Yeah. Oh, Krishna. <laughs> with the help <laughs> of yes. devotees. <laughs> yes, both of them, you can see they're young and, you know, they could be doing anything with their life. And I I'm not sure how Lochananda Prabhu ended up here. <laughs> Please tell us your story. After 10 years in Australia on the Gold Coast. <laughs> yeah, I was living there in Gold Coast. I was asking Jananand Maharaj what I should do in life. Uh, Maharaj asked me to travel with him a little bit. So when I traveled with Maharaj, I could see Jananand Maharaj was putting his heart and soul to help New Mayapur, France. So being in Australia, I never... I heard a little bit about New Mayapur in France, but... I did not know what it looks like or what, what, what is the temple like there. So uh, I had my doubts before I uh, mm -hmm. left Australia. But Maharaj uh, somehow gave me that faith inside my heart and inspired me to... When I was traveling, yeah, I, I decided I can come and help a little bit for a year and see how I go. But That's it. And he's been here how long now? Five, five years now. <laughs> Krishna blessed him with a wonderful partner who can help. And <laughs> I just want to share something very special about Gandharvika here. She also grew up in the Hare Krishna movement. Her parents are both Srila Prabhupada disciples. One of them. One of them. <laughs> so they've been around with this uh, temple community since your birth. You were yes. born and her now their daughter is also born in, um, in the locality. And you can feel the love like when we've come into this community this is our first time. Everything has been so sweet and welcoming and homely and uh, even just everything from prashad to the grounds to the guest house. There's a kids uh, playground, kids playroom. Everything is very meticulously thought of. And um, K Krishna Club. Oh, Raman's reminding me from the back that there's a wonderful <laughs> Krishna Club. They took all the kids into the woods and they made... What did you make? Um, like um, these kind of like, nature things. Nature <laughs> things. Right. The animals and bugs homes and swords and, <laughs> and the wonderful yeah, yagna kundas. Nature sword. nature sword. Not a real sword. <laughs> we don't want real sword. But they've just had such a wonderful time. So if you've got family and, uh, or even without family, <laughs> come. please come. That's yeah. what we need. More devotees visiting New Mayapur. Yes. So Prabhu, if you could share with us the, the amount that we're, we need to raise and maybe the timeline of um, how, much, how much time we have sure, before sure. the authorities come knocking again. So they were very impressed with the work we did in last few months. The government authorities, they were uh, very happy. So they extended up to October 31st to finish most of the work. So we were able to pay uh, most of the uh, down, payments. down payments to the companies and we started the work. The electricity company is here already. The local guy from the village is already working. So. In, in regards to the collection, I think we need approximately 600,000. Uh, we reached around 240,000 
Wow. So we have a long way to go. That's in a short time. So we are hoping Krishna Valaram will be, will be very merciful and uh, will inspire you all <laughs> to help donate a little bit. This is simply to upgrade the. Yeah, uh, all the fire safety, electricity, fire doors, uh, which is almost a hundred years old. Centralized alarm, and yeah, it's old. And this is good thing because the government is going to be like opening up like the place for the public. That means earlier there was no permit for receiving public, so now uh -huh. they let us do it. They are going to accept. We're going to work. This is opportunity work to work with the French government. This is blessing in disguise. Right, always everything always. that Krishna does, blessing in disguise. A bit of challenge, but. Uh, the result is going to be a win-win for us. So we've got a little bit over two months to raise a little bit over 300,000 yes. euros. Yes. So yes. please spread this uh, video to all of your family and friends, even if you can donate 10 pounds, 10 dollars, 10 rupees, <laughs> whatever you can give as a service to uh, Sri Sri Radha Govinda Madhavji. You in can uh, see the donation uh, page on our uh, website newmayapur.com and there there is the option to give monthly so if you cannot give a lot at once you can give every month uh, 10 20 50 pounds uh, or in one time whatever you can give is precious service uh, to uh, krishna yes and we want to preserve you know sanatana dharma this, this is such a rare opportunity to actually do something worthwhile with our money and our time you know, we, I, that, that opportunity to serve is so rare in our life, actually. We can spend money anywhere and try to have a good time anywhere, really. But to be able to serve a cause, uh, to protect dharma, to serve Sri Krishna, to serve Guru and Gauranga, that comes very rarely in life. <laughs> so we're desperately asking for your support because this has to be preserved. This tirtha, like Prabhu was saying, should be preserved. And uh, let's, let's give them encouragement <laughs> to continue with the wonderful seva here in Yumayapur Dham. Thank you. Thank Hare you. Krishna. Hare Krishna.